Hello, welcome to my channel, Claudio Mir here again. Let's talk today about Axis Camera and Blue Wires, the software, okay? So how can you add an Axis Camera to Blue Wires? It's pretty simple. As you can see, I have my web browser running with my camera. This is the Axis P1365 Mark II. And you can come to the Blue Wires software. Just hit here the plus sign on and include here the Axis name. Let's say Axis Camera. Here we go. And then you need a short name. Let's just say access network, enable audio. If you want to use audio, of course, hit OK. And here we go. Then you need to put here the camera's IP address. In my case, 192.168.052. Just make sure you have your IP camera in the same range of the computer that's running blue wires. OK, so access camera in blue wire server on the same ip range same network or you have at least a router that uh, routes to the correct location okay your network it's in order so you can continue here then you put here the username for access root and the password i'm gonna use one for testing and most of the time you see people clicking this find inspect button here Okay, to test your camera on the network. That's for OnVIF. You're not we are not using OnVIF here. As you can see, it start testing, check different brands and stuff like that, and says it's done or detected, but you're not using OnVIF here. Okay, so just ignore this part. You don't need to click here. Because you're you're using here root, the root password and root user and the password, you're not using generic only if you're using the cameras protocol so you need to come here to even find access camera okay and let's just come here to the beginning and start looking for access and here you go you have access and then on model you have different ones mjpeg M mpeg4 different models sometimes you have the models here sometimes you you don't so i have the p1365 mark ii so i don't have the name here what you have to do is come to this generic one m p and q series using h64 that's the codec that i'm using here and my camera is a p1365 so p series right select this one as you can see I have the RTSP stream here that the software is going to use to connect to the camera. It creates that for me. I don't need to insert anything here. I just need to insert here the IP address, the username and password and select access and the model P slash uh, M slash P slash Q series. Okay. Hit okay. Okay. Again, and wait for it to connect. A few seconds later, you see that it's connected and it's, it's running. I'm using here the Blue Iris Evaluation version, but still it works. Okay, so it's pretty easy. Okay, so that's all for today. I hope you liked this video. So don't forget to subscribe to this channel, leave a thumbs up and your comments. I see you in the next one.